Greetings, it is Maxo Diddley here, and today I'm here for another Java tutorial to you give that A in your coursework. And today we're here with a sequel to our customizing a J option pane video. So there's an eye up in the corner if you want to see it. I advise you do, as it is slightly based off that tutorial. So, on that video, we had a request from Night Owl. Firstly, he said he loves the short tutorials, and he calls me enthusiastic, and it gives him motivation to learn more code. I like to just say thanks a lot, that actually means a lot, it really makes a day to hear that my videos are helping, and that um, you enjoy them. So thanks a lot, your kind words really do make my day. And he then asked, any way to resize an image, e.g. make it smaller or make it full screen in the code rather than having to load the image into Photoshop and resizing it manually. And yes, there is a way, it's really simple, and it will work in many situations. So, let's get in what you have to do to resize an image in Java. So, firstly we have um, an image icon here, and it's got dab.png. We're going to display the image using a J-Option pane. So, there's not much code we have to do, so let's get right into it. Firstly, you need to make an image object. So, I want to go image. Then a name for your image, we're going to call it dab image, equals dab dot get image. And that is to be dab icon. So, what's going on here? So basically, we're making an image object, and it's going to take whatever image is stored in the dab icon image icon object. So basically, we're telling this image to become the same as this icon. Because we have to resize an image, we, we can't resize an image icon object. So, once we do that, we'll then do image, modified image, I'm going to call it dab image to keep the theme going, equals dab image dot get scaled instance. Then we're going to put in some sizes. So, we're going to put 600, 600, and then we're going to do java.awt.image.scale underscore smooth. So, a lot is going on here, so let us jump into it. So, we're creating another image object. This one is called modified dab image, because it's going to be a modified version of the dab image object. We get the name of the image we want to change, then we do dot get scaled instance, we put in a new X and a new Y in terms of size, like width and height, or whatever it is for a 2D image. Obviously, the one effect in the X axis and the one effect in the Y axis. Then, the third um, argument is for a scaling option. There are many types, so we're just going to do scale smooth because that's the highest quality one. Now that we've actually modified the image, we need to go back to our dab icon. Then you want to put dab icon equals new image icon, new dab image. And I need to actually put modified dab image, not new dab image. I don't know why I did that. So, what's going on here? So, we get the name of our image icon from before. Then we put equals new image icon. Then in here, we put the name of the image that we changed the size for. In this case, modified dab image. Then, obviously, we just refer to the icon again, and as you can see here, look, look how big that dab is. Now you can really express that you want to dab on those haters, and you should in life. If someone gets in your way and is hating on you, you just dab on them. I can't believe I'm saying this, like, this is like a running theme with this channel, with a video that came out last year when dab on your haters was somewhat relevant, and I'm continuing it. So please don't request more on this topic. I'm joking, if you want to, you can. Anyway, guys, thanks for being a great audience. Be sure to leave a like and a comment if you enjoyed. Uh, make sure you've imported these libraries as well. Be sure to subscribe if you want to see more. Leave a comment if you've got a request, or if you just want to give some kind words like Night Owl. So thanks for being a great audience, and I'll see you next time.